okay, so this is my completed chinchilla cage. Uh, took all, not quite a week, I'd say about four or five days to do all of these shelvings and all of the fleece stuff you see. I made everything by hand, uh, except for the cage obviously, and the bedding. And I just wanted to show you guys, because pictures and stuff are one thing, but actually looking at it, the camera is a little different. Move your butt. Move. My dog has been keeping me company while I've been working on it. This is the top level. I have two hammocks up here. This one's a little bit more loose. And then I just put this one in today because there was a corner hammock here, but I didn't think it was going to be big enough, so instead I made this sort of, I don't know, ledge type hammock. And I have my chiller over here on this top ledge. And down here, I really wish they made a way for like these doors to latch on while you have them up, because I have to like hold them up, otherwise they fall back down. So this is her little little hidey house that I made using a cardboard box and some fleece. Um, all the fleece stuff is no so too, so. And then over here is her lava ledge, and a little cuddle buddy, which is actually a mistake turned into a, a pillow. <laughs> And there's a couple more ledges over here, and then down here, there's her water bottle, somewhere, you can barely see the top of it. And then, the very bottom ledge, there's her water bottle, and a little hop spot so that she can get up over there, and another hammock. And I only put this one in here because this was just a big huge empty space. Yep. And it needed something here. And I didn't have any more ledges that would fit over here, so... I made another hammock. And another pillow that I had messed up doing. But, uh, when she gets a little bit bigger and older, and she needs a wheel, this is, I think it's gonna be more than enough room for a wheel, so... Yep. That's my chin cage. And I'm gonna go pick her up tomorrow. In uh, the afternoon, well, evening, I should say. And uh, she gets to run around in it. And I'm sure I'm going to take a little bit more videos of her bouncing around and checking it out. And this is Mystique. She likes the cage. I'm sure she'll like the chinchilla, too. You going to like the chinchilla? She likes cute furry things. She plays with the kittens at my store. I play with the kittens. Can you give me a high five? You missed. There you go. <laughs> good girl. That's a good girl. Oh, I'm excited. I'm sure she'll like it. I'm just worried about if she can jump that high. I'm pretty sure she can. I tried to make all of the le the jumps between the ledges pretty. Uh, close, I guess. Not that high. But, we'll see. I'll take video of her when she first gets here. And she's gonna romp around and play and stuff. Right. So I will see you guys tomorrow when she's here. And playing around in the cage. <laughs>